Hey guys, what is up? Welcome back to my YouTube channel. So, today's video, as you guys have read by the thumbnail and the title, is going to be another clothing haul. So obviously, if you guys haven't already, don't forget to subscribe, give this video a big thumbs up, and follow my socials. I have an Instagram as well as a Visco. Both of them are popping, so don't forget to check them out. And with that, let's get on with the video. The first item that I bought are these Brandy Melville sweatpants. So as you guys know, the only sweatpants I will ever buy are Brandy Melville sweatpants. I don't know what it is. They're just the softest, most comfortable sweatpants on the planet so i bought these from nordstrom the same place where i bought my blue sweatpants i will leave a picture of them up here but basically i bought these ones love them they're so much softer than the blue ones i don't know why but they're definitely softer the only issue i have with these ones is that i don't know for some reason the waist is too big for me but this is actually pretty big for me considering i would i'm pretty short and i don't have a waist this big but i don't know the waist is kind of really big for me and i don't know what's up with that but i folded it like this at the top so that it would sit like on my hips at least um and then i have them cuffed at the bottom because of course your girl is not the tallest person on the planet um but yeah these are super soft super comfy super practical for school um i don't know sleeping if you're going on a hike they're practical for anything. So the next item I bought are these leggings. So I have been looking for leggings that are just super comfy, kind of like sculpt your body instead of like compress it because I have compression leggings that basically just suck you in and they're really good, really, really good for like athletic stuff. Um, but I really needed a pair of leggings that I could just like look cute in, if you know what I mean, instead of like athletic wear. So I found these. These are literally identical to Lululemon leggings. So if you are looking for knockoff Lululemon leggings, this is where you go because I don't know what they are, but they're super soft. So these are actually from Aerie and they were about, I wanna say they were $40. Um, I will leave the price up on the screen. It's just a regular black color. They had tons of fun colors, but I didn't really know what to get and I was pretty indecisive. So I was like, you could never go wrong with black. So I bought those, just, it's the, um, chill play move leggings they are just like lulu's um i have tried lululemon leggings and they feel the exact same as those so would 10 out of 10 recommend these they're so soft and instead of sucking you in they sculpt you so these babies are definitely wonderful so this next item that i bought is actually just a full sleeve pink top so pink is it really a color that i lean towards like ever i know my entire room is pink everything is pink and pink and pink and pink but i promise pink is not my favorite color and i don't lean towards things that are pink but i did see this okay so this is technically not mine it's my mom's but i like stole it from her so i don't know where it's from but she bought it recently and I tried it on with leggings and my vans and I thought they were just so cute um, in an outfit. So they're just really basic. They look super pink on camera, but they're more of like a mauve kind of color, like a purple, purplish pink color. They look super pink on camera, but that's just because my entire room is pink, pink, pink and everything in my room just reflects pink. So it's like a purplish pink color, I would say. Super, it's like not bright, it's kind of dark and just super cute. It, it's really basic. I feel like there's not much description needed. It's kind of like a sweater because it is thicker than just like a t-shirt material for sure. But um, yeah. So my camera has like a grid on it right now and I don't know why. Um, I feel like there's not a grid normally on it, but there's a grid now. So I'm in the center and I can see that. Anyways, so I bought this super cute silver necklace from Forever 21. I actually went to Paxson that day and I couldn't find the lock necklace that I've been looking for for so long. Um, I looked online and it's there, but I don't want to go go ahead and order it right now just because I found another necklace that I think is just as cute. I've been wanting a dainty just like silver necklace for so long and I found this heart one, super cute. Um, I wear it basically every day. I don't have it on right now because I'm wearing pajamas basically. I just put on a decently presentable top so it looks like I'm not in PJs but I am. So yeah, my mom actually had a necklace just like this. I wanted something similar to that. Um, so I could like have it for myself if you know what I mean so I wouldn't have to keep stealing hers By the way link to my jewelry collection video somewhere in the i button because you should go and check that video out And obviously if you guys enjoyed this video don't forget to give it a big thumbs up Subscribe to my channel down below. We are trying to get to 16k at the moment I think 
or you know 20k would be absolutely epic so i'm so excited for new videos on my channel um i know i haven't been posting a lot recently i've just kind of been busy with school and like this whole coronavirus situation has just kind of consumed me and with that i will see you guys in my next video bye